Amateur Logic Shorts. Pen Type Digital Multimeters. I've been using this Pen Type Digital Multimeter for over 30 years. It's an auto ranging digital multimeter by Beckman, a CircuitMate DM73. What I like about these Pen Type DMMs is that you don't need to take your eyes off the probe when taking a reading. This greatly reduces the chance of slipping and shorting something out. Not to mention the very small size makes it handy for use anywhere. It measures voltage and resistance and has an audible continuity tester. It's auto ranging but not auto moding. In other words, you have to manually select the mode and select whether you are measuring AC or DC. Enter the 21st century. Out with the old, in with the new. It took me some searching to find something similar to my 30 plus year old circuit mate, which by the way, Beckman Industrial still exists, but is no longer in the test and measurement business. When searching on some of the online reseller sites, I stumbled on the MT-007 series pen type multimeter. In addition to basic multimeter functions, it also has non-contact voltage detection, and depending on which particular model you choose, it can also detect phase sequence for two-phase power. The entry level model has a typical LCD, whereas the Pro and Pro EN models have a color backlit LCD. These two deluxe models also feature phase sequence. The Pro model can measure frequency from 1 Hz to 10 MHz, and the Pro EN model has voice synthesis. Other than these differences, the other functions are all the same. I ordered the Pro model as I once had a talking DMM, and for me, the novelty wore off very quickly. While I'm not sure if the color LCDs are OLED or not, the display is high contrast and very clear. I'm sure that you know by now that the MT-007 is auto-ranging, but it also auto-detects what you are measuring. The literature mentions no need to switch gears, but I can tell you that there is nothing mechanical about the way that it functions, and there are certainly no gears involved. The MT-007 can also read ambient temperature in Celsius or Fahrenheit, minus 20 C to plus 50 C, or 0 Fahrenheit to 122 degrees Fahrenheit. The MT-007 can also be used as a non-contact voltage presence detector. When mains line voltage is present, the end of the pen lights up in red. On the business end of the MT-007, there's a selectable LED flashlight feature which does a good job of illuminating if you are measuring under poor lighting conditions. After 5 minutes of inactivity, the MT-007 will power off. Here is a chart of the various MT-007 model features and specifications. Here is what's in the box. A view of the underside of the MT-007 where the battery compartment is located. Note that you will need to supply your own AAA battery. Also note the attached ground cable. Here are images indicating the location of buttons, indicators, etc. The following images show the MT-007 in use, illustrating the various measurements that it's capable of. The MT-007 looks like it will make a worthy replacement for my aging CircuitMate DM73. It can be found on many of the online reseller websites. And oh yes, the best part? It can be years for around $20. Not bad for a 6,000 count resolution RMS meter. If you enjoy Amateur Logic Shorts, please click the like button. Be sure to click subscribe to be notified when new episodes become available. And let your friends know about this video by clicking share.